Thank you to Kettering University and Stryker Careers for their continued support. Learn more at the end of this video. What's going on?
back, relax, and let's hit it again. While you go tell your mother, father, cousin, the kid, and your other friends that don't even have a clue what this doo doo crew is about to do. You know it ain't fool's gold. This is Crip tonight. Super MCs freeze when I hit the mic. Right? EFF is the AKA. I keep it popping like Bubble W R A P. And if you don't know by now, then listen up, stupid. CSWS came to do it. Got more flavor than you and your crew. Kids, so get your hands together when you're ready to lose it. And bounce to the bounce of the break they beat. And like junior seniors, it's a move. All right, so that was Group D, kind of, um, as we had mentioned, uh, those were six teams from the, the Open Alliance. So leading it off was 43-29. Coming in strong with a really nice-looking uh, machine. They had swerve drive, they had a turreted shooter, and a climbing mechanism on there. We really didn't get to see all that kind of working cohesively together. Uh, but, man, if they really can, you know, piece that together and getting it working nicely, they'll be really hard to beat. So they'll be at the Heartland and the St. Louis Regionals this year. So good luck to 43-29 Lutheran Roboteers. Up next, we had 42-55, the Robodoras. Um, they introduced their machine component by component, um, then kind of showed it all working together, which is really cool to see. Um, their intake uh, is two cargo wide, but it really doesn't look like it jams if they're even because they even showed them um, putting a couple of uh, cargo in at the same time. Um, looks like it can score either level of the hub. Um, did kind of get a peep of their climber, but it really didn't get to see it in action. So uh, good luck to them um, as they compete this year. Um, and third, we had 3506 Yeti. Um, Yeti Robotics coming out with the teaser of all teasers. The robot Aurora is looking um, really nice. I really kind of dig their uh, minimal movement intake that they had there. Um, and it appears to have a strong shot as well. So looking forward to seeing them. Uh, they have two um, events this year in the FNC district, uh, UNC Asheville and UNC Pembroke. So we'll see that. And then Justin has the next three. Awesome. So we're going to start out with team 3636, Generals Robotics. So a really nice intake, the compliance mechanism. Uh, it's really going to be important. My observations from week zero events have been game pieces are going to really gather near the walls. And I just liked, I just liked in their video how it showed their uh, intake kind of reacting mm -hmm. against uh, hitting the wall at speed, which is nice. Climber looks uh, really nice. Um, and I'll say again, the fact that they're, you know, that there was so, so well put together at this point um, to be ready for reveal night uh, certainly is going to make them ready for their week two event, which is Wilsonville. So good luck to the generals, 36-36. Next up, the P-51 Mustang, 1745. I respect this robot so much. Uh, I think it's going to be an RP machine. During qualifications, they quickly and accurately load cargo into the lower hub and move closer and closer to the ranking point. Uh, there's something to be said for keeping it simple. Uh, with I still, I think, maybe on the traverse rung, um, just based on what I saw from the robot, excited to see this robot hit the field, and good luck to the P-51 Mustangs. And last but not least, uh, awesome little robot, uh, from one of the Open Alliance teams I followed the most, I just think that their documentation, um, you know, their, their yeah. kind of nightly and weekly posts uh, of their entire process was super helpful, not only for us, but definitely hundreds of teams across FRC. Uh, the use of 3D printing is also revolutionary, as you can see there <laughs> mm -hmm. on the screen. Um, they in, and really made their infinitely adjustable hood uh, possible. So the climb looks solid, and Spectrum will no doubt find success in the field. So good luck, and thank you to Team 3847 Spectrum. They have a pretty sleek looking like clear tube roller system and the only other yeah. time i feel like i've seen that was um i think 558 a few years ago had something similar and there's and maybe i think citrus maybe back in like 2014 but like a nice clear like clean looking robot this year i like how they have like the white rollers too it's mm -hmm. different than what we've seen on other teams yeah, and just a reminder, everybody, too, any of these uh, six teams you saw, plus the other three we'll be showing, uh, are all from the Open Alliance. Uh, so if you want to see any of their build blogs, you can go back and see their whole process. You know, every team's a little bit different how they document, but you can see actually, like, if you're interested in, like, Spectrum or Generals or another team they saw, what went into the robot, get some very detailed process. Uh, most of these teams we've also interviewed on fun, so you can get a bit more from there as well. Thanks to Kettering University for their support of this video. 
Over one third of Kettering's current students are former robotics team members. Go pro at Kettering University and get a free t-shirt. Students in grades eight through 12 and located in the continental US scan the QR code and complete the form by the date on screen and receive more information about Kettering. Thanks to Stryker Careers for their support in this video. First alumni and mentors are making Stryker a top priority for their internships and careers. That's because Stryker knows that those in first are the leaders and innovators of tomorrow. If you want to help make the world a better place by creating life-saving medical devices and technology, get started at careers.stryker.com. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell to stay up to date on our new videos. Keep the conversation going and provide your input to our content. Watch our live shows at twitch.tv forward slash first updates now. Join our Discord at discord.gg forward slash first updates now and check out Fun FTC on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and First Updates Now on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter.